Hey guys, Kevin Surpers USA here. So, for my personal training right now, I had to make up one of our duplex sandbags so I can actually get some hands on practice before this contest at the end of February. So, I figured what better opportunity than right now, since I have to fill one up, than to show you exactly how to fill your own up uh, once you get these off the website. So, stick around and uh, yeah, hopefully, this doesn't bore you too much because it is super, super simple. So once you get the bag out of the packaging, the very first thing we want to do is actually open it up. So as you can see here, I've already got it open. We have an uh, outer and then an inner Velcro strap, a zip inside, and then this internal liner that comes to. Once you've got that open, you literally just want to press inside and try and get some space in there. Now this can be a bit fiddly just because it's empty. Um, best way I like to do it is open this, and then just try and push it so we've got some shape to the bag uh, and then you can pour your sand straight in so the first bag is by far always the fiddliest and the most sort of uh, riskiest shall we say of making a mess so we need to be really careful with that obviously it's just sand so you know it's not as if it's a bomb anyway so we've just got our first bag we should be super careful Slowly getting it poured in there. As you can see, the bag is starting to fill and it's just right there about the tip. So, right when it's about the tip, lift it, stand it up. Now you've got a little bit more support because of the sand on the bottom, and we can be a little bit more haphazard with how we're filling them. Over here. As you can see, I'm about to go again. I'm just going to stand up. Stand it up and move it around a little bit. So normally, I would do this outside, but it's like 12 degrees outside, so we're not doing that today. So I'm going to keep filling this, and then I will come back to you once I've put like another four bags in. So right now, I am two bags of sand in. And all we're going to do right now is literally just hold on to the liner and we're just trying to settle everything. So we're just picking, banging a little bit, and that's it. We're just trying to get everything to settle, bag to um, basically stand by itself completely. So yeah, there we go. And then it's two more and I'll see you in a minute. So that's we've got all my sand in the bag now, fully loaded. You can sort of see it here right up to the top. So what I want to do now is I literally just want to hold this piece, just shake a tiny bit just to get it moving, see how much more space there is. Now I have enough space where I can fit probably another 10, 20 pounds of sand in here. I did actually only fill this with four bags of sand, so it is only 200 pounds, and so it is a 220 pound capacity bag. If this was going to a contest, I would fill this sucker up super, super tight, that way you minimize any movement in the actual shell because it's training I want it a little bit looser and more so because I don't know what kind of bags I'm going to get this contest so I'm going to leave it here and then to finish up it's literally a case of you pull this Oops, let me take this piece up you pull this tight it's got velcro inside and we're just getting all the velcro nice there and then we are going down this way so there's another piece of velcro here Connect all that together, then this piece, this liner piece, gets tucked inside here, one, and two for the corners, zip it up, Oops. Get that nice and straight, and put the first flap down, and then second flap over, here we have it, all done. Sandbag ready to go. Hardly any mess either. So, if you have any questions, put them in the comments below. Let me know.